everyone, it's Veronica. Welcome back to my channel. Um, yeah, I literally have not posted in over six months because I've just been busy with um, life, school. I really don't have an excuse. I just have not been filming. But I thought it would be fun to show you guys what a day in my life at CUHK is like because I'm currently studying abroad at the Chinese University of Hong Kong in Hong Kong. So, um, yeah, I thought I would take you guys around. Um, I have no makeup on right now because I literally just woke up and my skin has been horrible in Asia because of the humidity. So, um, yeah. Check out my view, by the way. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it, but very, very beautiful picture. And I think that's Sha Tun over there. And I live in on campus in New Territory. So yeah, um, I have one class today. So we're gonna get ready for that. That's my Chinese class. And I actually need to study for before my exam because I have an exam every week. So yeah. I just finished putting on my makeup. Um, I'm really not wearing much. Okay, the lighting is much better from over here. By the way, I live in a triple. Um, my one roommate moved out and we have another girl moving in sometime this week so i'm excited to meet her but anyways for my makeup i just did a little bit of powder concealer eyebrows and mascara and then for my shirt i'm wearing this lululemon long sleeve and then purple leggings from lulu and then my ultra boost super casual uh, my internship is super casual it reminds me of like bay area startups because it is a startup and everyone just dresses really casually which i really really like so yeah um let's get to class I am very out of breath because I'm currently walking up like five flights of stairs. So that's what I have to do every day. There's my dorm behind me. It's Daisy Lee and we have like this beautiful view, and, like this infinity pond. So I'm going to walk by this every morning when I leave for school. I live in New Asia. This university is like divided into like different colleges and I would say like the school spirit. Oh, oh I'm so out of breath. The school spirit is not that strong, but the college spirit is very strong. Like people wear a bunch of like college merch, like that they would say like New Asia or United College or Lee Busing, just, oh my God, it's out of breath. This was actually the first dorm I ever lived in here. It was like my orientation hostel, or it was actually my full-time hostel before I got bed bugs. And it's Shresu, which is the oldest dorm on campus. And it's also all girls. So it's just like UC Evans at U of I. I don't know how I always get, placed into dorms like that oh my god I'm really out of shape guys I don't only really work out here because I just hang out with friends and I just trap this is slightly embarrassing yeah this is our MTR stop right here and I normally go over there to buy baozi for breakfast which is like a Chinese um I don't know it's just bread and vegetables or meat on the inside and um called Tonkyu Bao Dim, and this is the menu. Eating my bell right now. And this is the bus terminal where everyone waits in line to take the buses up the mountain because we all live on the mountain and then the entire school is like built on a mountain. So yeah. I'm sitting in class right now with my Chinese textbook next to me. I'm also reading right now because the professor has not come yet. And um, this is what um, the classroom looks like. I just got out of Chinese class and I'm so embarrassed to be filming around school because I have not filmed in so long. By the way, this is like the Yasumoto International Center, so the buildings here are very nice. And it's 12.15 and I start work at 1 and it takes around 30 minutes to get to Kowloon Bay, which is where I work. So I'm going to grab a quick lunch really quick right by our MTR station. I'm going to eat at Maesam, which is Maxime's, which is a really good restaurant and I really like it. And I like that they take credit card because no canteen on campus takes credit card and i don't have that much cash because i'm not used to carrying cash so um i'm gonna go over right now after ordering at restaurants you always wait in this line and then you give them your receipt with your order and then you just wait for your food this is what my lunch typically looks like i got barbecue pork with um, vegetables and tofu and i also got a nice lemon tea I just left the university stop and then we are going to take it to Kowloon Tan and then switch on over to Kowloon Bay, which is where I work. I have like a 15 minute walk to my office. I just got off at Kowloon Bay and I'm in the MTR station still and actually a lot of MTR stations in Hong Kong um, have malls inside of them, which makes it very distracting because I love to shop and lots of people right now, but this does not compare to when I'm gonna leave the office later, but later in a little bit because 
Oh my god, I just walked up some stairs and I'm out of breath again. But um, Peloton, I feel like there are a lot of offices here. I actually don't know this area very well because I've only been interning here for a few weeks. But there's actually a branch of HKU here, which is Hong Kong University, which is another university here in Hong Kong. And yeah, off to work. Lots of offices in this area. I don't know, there's not much to show you. My old cubicle used to be by the window and I work on the 28th floor, so it was really, really nice, but I got another cubicle. So now there is no view. Just got to work and actually no one's in the office where I'm at right now. Okay, oh my. This is the view and this is just Kowloon Bay. And yeah, I just got to work, so yay. I just left work and I actually left around like five or 10 minutes earlier than normal because today it's Halloween. So obviously we're gonna go out and normally it's like completely dark when I walk home, but the sunset is actually behind me and it's so beautiful and it's around a 40 minute MTR ride back and I am going to be meeting my friend Abby for dinner. So that should be fun. This is where the rush hour nightmare starts and everyone just slowly makes their way to the MTR station. The station is significantly emptier than normal for some reason. I don't know why, but I think like the five minutes really does make a difference. But if you guys see so many people in front and behind and this is the train that was just too packed for us to get on. So yeah, and then we have like these guys that make sure that we don't overpack the train. I don't know what's going on over there, but supposedly it's this big CUHK tradition where all the colleges gather and they have their own chants. I don't know if you can hear it. But yeah, I also just got candy, peach rings. That is the main library behind me. I'm sorry I wasn't able to show you much of my camps today just because the only time I was on campus this was this morning when I was going to Chinese class. And I'm now meeting my friends for dinner. We're gonna go eat at a canteen called Veg It Together, which is a vegan place because there's literally like not very good. I was gonna say there's literally no good food on campus, but there's some good food so there's just like not that many options but um walking over right now we just got to the canteen and this is my friend joanne hi i hate veronica <laughs> oh, no she does friends. not what'd you get i want noodles and tomato soup and fish balls she's from toronto by the way hi <laughs> i'm abby what'd you get and i got the same thing as veronica which is chicken satay Sate. Yum. She says, sate. she says sate. Tate. I, we say sate. sate. Yeah, so, so how do you guys white. say sate? What the frick? We're gonna eat our food now. We are currently <laughs> checking out at Fusion, which is the campus grocery store. That's me, it's stuck in my teeth. Okay. No. <laughs> um, what'd you get, Joanne? Uh, soju and milkus? What'd you get? Oh, soju and milkus. Oh, soju and milkus? Soju? It's Halloween, so, yeah. Paul? So today I got, um, milkus. And so would you. <laughs> That's oh, it. Sorry. That's it. Bye, guys. So, I just finished getting ready. I still need to curl my eyelashes, but I would say makeup is pretty much done. I did it really quickly. I have my hair in a bun right now. By the way, yeah, I came back after going grocery shopping to get ready. I'm going to do two Dutch braids, though. And then, this is my outfit. I got this robe from the ladies' market. Um, Adidas sports bra and Lululemon running shorts. And I'm wearing my Stan Smiths, except I feel like it's a little too black right now. So I'm gonna try on this outfit with my free to be wild white sports bra and um, we're gonna see if it is better or worse than the all black look. Okay, I just put on this white bra. I feel very, very naked on is this. Everyone, oops. Oh no, this is my roommate, Eugenia. She said I'm not allowed to show her, but um, just wanted to let you know, um, she is here, she's Italian. Actually, do you wanna just say hi? Hey. Hey, ciao, Eugenia. <laughs> I'm kidding, but um, yeah, I'm gonna wear this white one, I think, and let's go find my friends. What were you gonna say? Me? Yeah, we're, I'm, I'm not showing you. Your friends are wearing. Yeah, we're all wearing similar stuff. Yeah. We're gonna go find my friends right now. Abby just finished showering, and Aaron has actually joined us in Daisy Lee. Uh, looks like Does this look weird? Okay, bye guys. <laughs> well, we just finished getting ready. Um, Joanne's taping up her hand. Yeah, that looks a lot better. <laughs> Um, they said that I put too much tape on my hands, but I really don't <laughs> think so. They're calling me a mummy. <laughs> yeah, we're about to meet up with some friends at the MTR station, and we're going to go to Lang Kwai Fong, which is LKF, which is where all the nightlife is, so that'll be so a lot of fun. Tight. This is so tight. <laughs> uh, we are currently walking to the MTR station. 
We got ready pretty fast. <laughs> I've also never done my hair like this. Um, Abby's in front of me. Joanne and Erin are behind me and we're meeting some of our other friends at the station. I think I said that already. That's we just got off the subway and we just arrived in El Kayak and there I've are I've never so seen so many people here. Yeah, we literally have never seen so many people here. It is so packed and they have signs to tell us where to go. Um, anyways, I think I'm gonna end the vlog <laughs> Guys, here. Oh, wait. I was gonna say though, I'm actually not that weird. <laughs> I'm not gonna put that last clip in. I'm refilming it right now. Do you wanna say anything new? Um, hi guys, I'm Joanne. Subscribe to her, stay in all chaos. <laughs> First time in all chaos. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna um, end the vlog here for tonight and I'm gonna have some clips for the rest of the night. And yeah, comment down below for more videos, like this video, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Taxi back to school mm -hmm. with Abby and Catherine. Yeah, Dolan and Dash, right? And Melissa's up front and mm -hmm. going back to Satyan. What a night. Happy mm -hmm. Halloween, everybody. Mm -hmm.